afternoon folks, Big Bo here with another great diesel Class A motorhome value from Parkway RV Center. Folks, I got a nice one today. Uh, one of my personal favorite motorhomes, the Winnebago Journey. This is a 2005 Winnebago Journey 36G. Got the optional 350 horsepower, 7.2 liter Cummins turbo diesel. Uh, came standard with a 300. This was a very expensive option. This thing is loaded with about every option you can put on it. In fact, I've got the original factory window sticker inside. With 40, It had $45,000 worth of add-on options added to it when it was ordered new, bringing it up to $199,000. Of course, folks, this unit's only got 56,000 miles, which anybody that knows anything about diesels will tell you that's not even remotely broken in. It's got the optional full body paint, 7,500 watt diesel generator. It's got the optional Alcoa wheels, the optional power awning, optional power door awning, and much, much, much more, folks. Freightliner chassis, got the air suspension. Folks, this unit's gonna come with a 90 day nationwide limited warranty and include a major systems check by our certified RV techs. And folks, this is the unit, like I said, was $200,000 new. You can buy it today for $64.9. And look these things up online, folks. You can check the NADA, the RV Trader, eBay. Considering everything this coach has on it, this thing is a bargain. 350 horsepower, 7.2 liter Cummins Turbo ISC. Got all fiberglass roof. Now this unit just came in, so you're looking at it just how I got it. It's got two slide outs, both with awning toppers. The Journey, of course, uh, built by Winnebago. I own a Winnebago myself. They're the only brand that actually build 80% of their own parts in-house. So the advantage of that over other brands is no matter how old your Winnebago is, they've got most of the parts in stock for it. And they're also one of the few brands that you can order directly from the factory. In other words, say you need that compartment door uh, 20 years from now. You buy this motor on 20 years from now, you have a blowout. You need that compartment door. You give Winnebago your VIN number, a couple of weeks, they'll have that door right at your doorstep. And uh, you do that with other brands that are all, because most other brands are built with all aftermarket parts. And of course, aftermarket companies, folks, they go out of business every few years. They make certain parts obsolete where you can't get them and makes it really a pain when you deal with other brands, but not with the Winnebago. That's why I've owned two of them, folks. I'm gonna try to squeeze through here. I don't know if I'm gonna make it or not. If not, it'd make a pretty good blooper video because I would be pretty pretty much stuck here. Uh, it's, of course, I don't know how well you can tell it. It's got the store and more cargo area with the slide outs come out with the cargo bays. Uh, Winnebago also the only brand with a standard low maintenance fiberglass roof. Winnebago is also the only one of the only brands that has their own in-house frame shop. Several years ago, actually about 20 something years ago, Winnebago wasn't happy with the quality of the frames that they were getting from their aftermarket vendors. It's the same vendor that provides frames just about any other RV manufacturer out there. So they actually invested a lot of money, built their own frame factory. So every frame on every Winnebago motorhome since then, built and designed by Winnebago engineers and built by Winnebago just for Winnebago products. In other words, you're not sharing the same frame as a Coachman or a Fleetwood or a Holiday Rambler. These are all custom built frames just for Winnebago. So it's designed to be as efficient as possible. Uh, of course, it's got the 22.5 Alcoa wheels and tires look great. Outside entertainment center, so the power Illumigard awning, it's got a power satellite system and much, much more folks. Like I said, 45 grand in options in 2005, which is translates to about 65,000 in options today if you bought a 17 model with the same equipment. Let's take a look inside this 36G. You're gonna love the interior, folks. As we step inside, this unit has had the hardwood floors installed in it instead of the carpet. 
there still is some carpet and the little bit of carpet that's left is great and they actually did this right folks i know i did one of i don't know last week or so and when you put a when you put hardwood in a winnebago products this is what you run into if you don't make the hardwood lower than the factory carpet the slide out is going to scrape it because these things are so precision engineered that if you do anything that's taller than the factory carpet in other words like a lot of people do they'll just put hardwood over the carpet or put put a backing board or something like that where the hardwood is t is higher up than the carpet and what happens is when you bring your slide in it's going to it's going to scrape on the sides but this one right here folks you can look at it looks great no scrapes they did this right and they actually put the hardwood floors underneath where the factory carpet would go so if you're going to put hardwood floors in one this is how you want to do it to, pre to prevent problems just a little tidbit of information right there but anyway i don't know where to start on this dash <laughs> it's got a navigation it's got a xm radio six speed allison 3000 transmission dash air is ice cold Roof air is ice cold. Well, it's not roof air. It's a basement air. I mean, we're sitting here at idle in a diesel blowing low 40s out the dash air. Actually, upper 30s. Got the backup camera system with the checklist built in. Got the little driving computer. Um, of course, got the redundant audio, uh, redundant wiper controls. All that built into the steering wheel. Heated power mirrors. The Trip Tech computer system. This is pretty neat. When you're driving or getting ready to drive and you crank your motor home up, you'll have a checklist that pops up on this screen and you go through it and check off every little thing before you can use your camera system. So that way you don't forget to put your antenna down or lock your door or make sure your awning's secured or make sure your slide outs are secured or jacks are up and things like that. Stuff that, if you forget, can cost you a lot of money if you screw up and pull off. Uh, with those systems not secured uh, battery cut off switches here for everything slide out air brakes air suspension got a great ride and drive to it we just drove it 500 miles in I mean wow so you got a Cobra nav system dash looks great glass is perfect HD TV overhead 10 disc CD changer of course uh, satellite system both your captain's chairs are leather. They're both built by Winnebago and they swivel for party seating. And the passenger side is a recliner and it does have a step cover that comes out uh, for, for the passenger to set their feet on. Winnebago builds the interior. Winnebago builds the frame. They build the exterior. They build the furniture. They build the cabinets. Uh, something other brands can't say, folks. This is uh, their uh, sleep I shoot, I can't remember the name of the top of my head, folks. But they've got a patent on this sleeper sofa. This is a power leather sleeper sofa, and it makes a actual standard size queen bed. It's got a, a tray that comes out the bottom and folds up and makes a queen size bed. A lot more comfortable than the sleeper sofa or the futons. Uh, books and manuals are in it. Uh, table booth makes a bed. You've got Corian countertops. Uh, Euro style chair. Padded headliner, of course, Winnebago's famous roof system. Nothing out there stronger than this, folks. Uh, fiberglass roof. Very, very little maintenance. Got the 12 cubic foot refrigerator freezer. Microwave confection oven and your second gas oven as well as a stove top. Now, folks, let me go ahead and get my disclaimer out of the way. Um, you know, I'm going to show you this real quick before I do that. This is original build sticker. All the options, and I took a picture of it if you want to look through every little thing. But just to summarize it, twelve five for the 350 horse upgrade, uh, $7,000 for the full body paint. It's got the diamond shield on the front that's $1,200. Generator was extra. $45,114 in total options, bringing the price to $199. Might as well say $200,000, folks. Now, folks, this unit was $200,000 new. It's $64,900 now. And my disclaimer is this. This is a savings of $135,000. And that's not counting the fees and stuff that the new dealer charges that we don't. 
$135,000 in savings, folks, to only use it for 56,000 miles. I mean, to me, that's ludicrous to lose that kind of money for only 56,000 miles of use. But, and here's my disclaimer, folks, this is a used motor home. It was new 12 years ago for $199,000. It will never be new again. That $135,000 in savings comes with a price that everybody has to pay whether you're buying from us, another dealer, or for sale by owner, and that price you have to pay is that everything on this motorhome is 12 years old, folks. The furniture is 12 years old. The appliances are 12 years old. The exterior, everything on this motorhome except the tires has 12 years of age and 12 years worth of use. It's not going to be perfect. There's going to be imperfections, and we're not going to do anything about the imperfections, folks. Not for what we sell them for. What we will do is do a major systems check by our certified RV techs and make sure the functionality of everything in this works like it's supposed to. In other words, we're going to make sure uh, the motorhome runs and drives like it's supposed to. We're going to make sure the refrigerator works like it's supposed to. The uh, air conditioner, the heat pump, the furnace, the plumbing system works without any leaks. We want to make sure all the lights work, all the cabinets and drawers work, the sofa and table fold into beds like they're supposed to. We're going to make sure the awnings in great, both awnings are in great shape. Uh, we're going to make sure the microwave, confection oven, stove top and oven work. All We make sure your propane system works like it's supposed to without any leaks. We're going to make sure, folks, that when the jacks and slide outs and all that works like they're supposed to. Now, uh, and, and of course, if we find anything wrong with it, we're going to fix it as far as in, that, in those systems. Now, as far as the cosmetic stuff, and I'll show you a couple of things that come to mind. Uh, it looks like it sometime in the last 12 years, they've dropped this sink cover and glued it back. I'm not going to fix that. That's part of buying a 12-year-old motorhome. It's not going to be perfect. It's going to be a nice 12-year-old motorhome, but it's still going to be 12 years old. It's definitely going to be one of the nicer 12-year-old motorhomes on the market, especially for this price range with the options it has. But it will have imperfections, folks. You know, the it may have a, a ding, dent, scratch, ding, uh, dent, worn spot, may have a stain. It, it could have any number of things it, it may or may not have. But that's part of buying a 12-year-old motorhome. And, and I'm not trying to discourage you from buying used because used is definitely smart because obviously buying this one 56,000 miles, you're saving 135,000. So somebody lost their butt on this thing. But like I said, that price that every buyer has to pay is that everything in this thing's 12 years old. It's not going to be perfect. Don't come in here expecting to buy a perfect used RV because if it was absolutely perfect, if it was absolutely new, it would be $199,000 instead of $64,900. And don't get me wrong, folks, the new ones are more. I mean, you're talking a quarter of a million dollars now for the same for the same motor home thanks to inflation. So it's not going to be perfect. Got a couple of windows, and I'll go ahead and point this out. These are dual-pane windows. The seals break in them. The nitrogen gas fogs up. The only thing you can do about it is, of course, you can still see out the windows just fine. But a couple of windows have that, and that's just part of buying a used one, folks. The only way to replace that, or fix that, is replace the glass, and that's several hundred dollars of pain. We're not going to be able to do that for what we're selling this RV for, folks. Get online, check the NADA, check what other dealers are asking for a comfortably equipped 2005 36G. You're going to see we've got the lowest price on the internet. Base models with the 300 horse, no full body paint, no satellite without hardly any of the options this thing has and they're, they're bringing just as much as this one with more miles so this is in a great buy this one's not going to last long of course Winnebago has their own cabinet shop all solid hardwood cabinet slide out pantry and this thing has got the basement air conditioner let's talk about that for a second folks the basement air conditioner is what Winnebago came out with Coleman builds them for them and they, and they only build them for Winnebago products and instead of having the two air units on your roof, the basement air unit is one unit like a house. It's 25,000 BTU. It's 40% more efficient and 10% quieter than the roof units. Plus, you don't have those roof units, you know, uh, catching wind. And you got to worry about replacing the shrouds every couple of years because they get brittle and break like you do with the roof units. Uh, and it's quieter, it's more efficient, and you only have to keep up with one unit instead of keeping two units serviced. So, uh, and you also get the added benefit in this particular model 
is it it also has an electric heat pump like a house has so you have electric heat you've got gas heat a dsi furnace as well and then of course you've got the air conditioner and is this air conditioner cold you better believe it look here i'm i'm, I'm at least a foot and a half from the vent and i'm blowing 20 something degree 20 something degrees out of that thing and it's great airflow you're not going to get hot in this RV, folks. I will promise you that. If you're going to go in the dead of summer to Florida or Arizona, New Mexico, you're not going to get hot as long as you've got that air conditioner running. 12 cubic foot refrigerator freezer built-in ice maker. This was an option as well. In fact, I'm going to cut that air off in a minute, folks. It's going to be ice cold. You can see. Looks great, and it's already, and I haven't had this on very long, but, I mean, it's 10 degrees, so obviously it works. And, uh, of course, if I left this on for a few hours, it would get colder like it's supposed to, but we do guarantee that to work. That's also covered under that 90-day nationwide limited warranty, but, folks, when we get done with this motor home after my RV takes get through with it, you're not going to need that warranty, but you get it anyway, and it can be extended very affordably. Uh, books and manuals, there's the factory brochure, and like I said, folks, look at the savings. I mean, $199,000, $45,000 worth of options. Like I said, that, gen that, that motor upgrade for that 50 extra horsepower is $12,000, $7,000 upgrade for the paint. It's got a 2,000 watt inverter. That was a $900 upgrade. The extra chair, that Euro style chair, was eight hundred dollars. I mean, it's amazing. It's got power. It's got two powered sun visors. Those are three hundred seventy-eight dollars. Um, the generator, you know, came standard with a six-point-five propane generator. The upgrade to that one, it is approximate. Uh, that's a forty-six hundred dollar add-on for that diesel generator over the factory propane one. Wow. <laughs> Somebody. Obviously, money wasn't an object. Whoever purchased this one knew. Like I said, the hardwood floors look great. Corian countertops. You've got a walk-through bathroom. Uh, medicine cabinet. Seamless Corian sink. Built-in hair dryer. Shower. And you can look around the skylight. You know, folks, even though this is a fiberglass roof, you still have some maintenance to do. There's no such thing as a maintenance-free roof at all. Uh, you still got to go up there. Uh, you got to seal around your skylight, seal around your antenna, your satellite, anything that's stuck to the roof. Uh, you got to seal around it. I do mine once a year. That may be overkill, but I'd rather be safe than sorry. It takes me less than 30 minutes to do my 38 foot Winnebago. So let's get you some self leveling caulk. I use uh, ProFlex, but Dicor is a good brand as well. There's a bunch of brands out there that you can use, and they all do the same thing. Uh, in here, you've got the upgrade porcelain RV toilet storage you got to upgrade fantastic vent fan open this up right here and you've got the washer and dryer combo that was a thirteen hundred dollar option back in 05 of course this right here is your hookups and plugins all hidden out of the way well designed well engineered well equipped Winnebago right here folks and this is like I said the journey we sell a bunch of these things they're one of my favorite brands and definitely my favorite manufacturer personally and i've been around these things 20 plus years i've owned several motorhomes and there's only a handful of brands that i would personally own and winnebago is definitely at the top of that list big closet uh got a lighted closet you've got an hd tv back here looks like somebody's added that but it's it's a good size tv for this bedroom um big hanging closet I mean, storage should not be an issue. You've got nightstands on each side. You've got your own private stereo system. You've got the lights on a dimmer. You've got a ceiling fan back here. Um, comfortable mattress. This mattress at one point has been changed. Um, originally had a sleep number bed and it's just got a standard pillow top mattress now. So and it looks like brand new. Got a private door right there. Well, I'm just telling you that so you know you're not laying on a 12-year-old mattress. But I uh, got a solid sliding privacy door. 
uh, that completely cuts off the bedroom from the bathroom and then you have another sliding door if you want to separate the bedroom and bathroom from the rest of the coach. Folks, this unit's in great shape. It's got the warranty, it's got the inspection. It's priced so far under book, so far under what other dealers are asking for us. A comfortably equipped 36, 2005 36G journey. It's not even funny, folks. Um, this one's going to sell quickly. It's going on eBay, RV Trader, RVT, RV USA, and 20 of them, and about 20 of the most popular RV for sale websites on the internet. Hundreds of people are going to see this video in the next 24 hours. Thousands of people are going to read the ad, see the pictures. Somebody's going to buy this thing. It's springtime. This thing, to find a deal like this, this time of year, is very, very hard uh, because right now stuff is at a premium. Even for me as a dealer to go buy stuff to resell, prices have shot up in the last few weeks because it's springtime, folks. This is the time everybody gets out, buys RVs, and to find a deal like this is just something that you're not going to find every day. Like I said, folks, $135,000 in savings. Beautiful RV. Has every option you can, amenity you can think, and much more. <laughs> oh, that's a gas electric water heater too. And it's got surround sound, surround sound speakers. But anyway, folks, I, I mean, I could literally do a two-hour video on this if I wanted to, showing you everything on it, but I just, I don't have the time, and I'm sure y'all don't either. So if you really want one that's nice, clean, well-equipped, not been smoked in, not any pad odors, this is definitely the one for you. Give us a call, 706-965-7929. Evenings and Sundays, you can get sales help at 423-605-6747. Visit our website, parkwayrvcenter.com or .net. I'll go ahead and show you the roof, too. I know a lot of people don't do that because a lot of them, if they've ever leaked, that, that padded headliner hangs down, but you don't have a problem with this one. But anyway, folks, our website, again, is parkwayrvcenter.com or .net. We got over 170 used RVs in stock, more than any dealer within a 500-mile radius of us. We've got the lowest prices on the internet. We're one of the oldest, largest, and most successful independently operated, family owned, or family operated and owned used RV dealerships in the United States today. We sell five to 600 used RVs a year because we have the lowest prices. We've sold to buyers from all 50 states, including multiple sales to buyers from Hawaii and Alaska. We've sent a couple of thousand plus RVs all over Canada coast to coast. We've sent them overseas to England, Italy, Australia, the Netherlands, and other countries, folks, because of our prices. Can't beat them. You can't beat the quality of our units. We don't have any extra add-on fees. The price is what you pay. It's $64.9. Haggle-free, out the door. You know, we've gone to haggle-free pricing, folks. Best thing we've ever done. It eliminates the stress because I know everybody that's going to look at our RVs is going to get online. They're going to compare prices for the same make and model from other dealers. So when you see how many thousands less than we are than anybody else, you're going to see why we say haggle pricing, haggle free pricing. So there's no need that eliminates the number one fear of anybody buying a used RV is paying too much. That eliminates that problem once you research and see what these things are bringing and what the book value is. We also, folks, have out the door pricing and that saves you additional thousands of dollars because these other RV dealers that are asking thousands of dollars more for their RV, they're going to hit you up with around 10% of the asking price in extra fees like dock fees, prep fees, uh, get ready fees, freight fees, uh, processing fees, warranty fees. Of course, you know, most other brand, other dealers don't give you a warranty on a 05 model that's bought as is we do. And no extra charge. And much whatever name they can come up with for those fees, folks, they're all 100% dealer profit, 100% unnecessary to purchase a used or new RV. And almost 50 years, half a century of doing business, we've never charged a fee. We never will. We have financing available, rates as low as 4% with approved credit. You can apply right from our website, ParkwayRVCenter.com. Uh, folks, golly bum, we got extended warranties. We can we can sell you at dealer cost. We have free airport pickup. We actually have four or five sets of customers a week fly into Chattanooga, Tennessee Airport. We'll pick you up for free during business hours. Bring you back here and show you the motorhome. 
We make it simple, no commission salespeople, no games, no gimmicks, no haggling, no worrying about what kind of fees we're going to add to the deal once you, once you come to pay for it. Because it is all out the door, haggle free, plus sales tax, of course, if you're a Georgia resident, since we're a licensed, bonded, insured Georgia RV dealer for almost 50 years, we are, we do have to collect sales tax from Georgia residents. All out-of-state residents, like most of our customers come from, will pay their sales tax, their state sales tax rate. When they tag and title this motor home at their local DMV office at their home state, you get a 45-day temp tag included, no extra charge, a free starter kit, all your camping essentials, a walkthrough by one of my RV technicians after it's been gone through, uh, instructional DVDs, and much more. So give us a call. Drop us an email, sales at parkwayrvcenter.com. We're on Twitter, we're on Instagram, we're on Facebook. Uh, like this YouTube video, subscribe to my YouTube channel. I've got, golly bum folks, over 5,000 subscribers. They get email notifications every time I post a video. And uh, that way, if you see something on the video title you like or you think you might be interested in, you can just click on it, watch the video, and you never know because a lot of times... The video post a day or two before the ad post, so it kind of gives all my viewers a heads up about uh, what's going to be out there for sale and gives you a chance to buy it, folks, because I can't tell you how many ads I've run and they sold within two or three hours of the ad posting on the internet. I'm talking about somebody sees it, they call it, they leave a deposit, and they wire us the money or come get it with a check or however they decide to do it, but you'll be surprised. The hundreds of RVs that we've sold within three or four hours of the ad posting. There's tons of serious buyers out there and when you can save this kind of money people will travel thousands of miles sometimes to save this kind of money like you're going to save on this one. So give us a call, drop us an email. We can arrange nationwide delivery too. But thank you for watching. Look forward to seeing you here in beautiful Ringo, Georgia.